this is so weird. Okay, so I want to get better at vlogging. And in order to get better at vlogging, I wanted to use my iPhone camera because my iPhone camera is a lot better than my actual like camera camera. I don't know how to explain it. I've had this camera. I've had this camera for literally ever. And while it's a great camera, my stomach is growling. I'm so hungry. I didn't eat yet today. I will eat, I promise. I just today was a great day to the second day of the new year. I was struggling so bad to get my setup ready for content that it's already noon and I'm just starting this week's vlog now. Or like, I, I still haven't decided if I'm gonna do daily or weekly vlogs. I guess it kind of just depends on how today's vlog goes and if I like it. But anyways, I have this camera and I really, really like it, but it's not the best. I'm not great with camera settings, but I've also dropped this camera and used this camera a few different ways. So it needed, it, it it's in need of some love and fixing, to be completely honest. You know what I just realized too? My microphone audio is probably terrible because I don't have my mic. I don't know if this changed the audio and if I go ahead and come back to the footage later and it's horrible audio quality, will I be salty? Absolutely. We can now get ASMR of my tummy grumblies. I'm so stinking hungry. Let me eat them. Now I know that this is for USB-C. I'm laying because I still have an iPhone 14. But that's what I'm going to record today's vlog on. I'm going to record today's vlog on my phone, see how I like it. I have a new light, I have my mic, I have some minor upgrades with my Christmas money that I got. Well, not Christmas money. Everyone gave me gift cards, so my gift cards got put to my templates because I really, 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 Anyways, I kind of want to take the Alexson's approach, like how she does her vlogs. I really want to be very raw, very natural, very laid back in a sense. Like I want it to feel like you're clicking on my videos to talk to a friend. And I know that that's not great in terms of like growth wise, but I will have videos that are gauged more towards my growth, but my vlogs are going to be more so for my followers and myself. So yeah. Anyways, today with the technical difficulties of this morning, I'm really thankful that I already have one of my tasks done, which was write some YouTube scripts. So I have some video scripts written for this upcoming month, actually. I have a whole bunch of stuff done. Yeah, and then I pretty much just have to work on commissions. So I'm probably gonna clean up my art supplies, clean up my paintbrushes that have been marinating in the same water for the last couple of days, um, clean up my supplies, set up my desk to paint, and finish these commissions, because I gotta get them mailed out, I gotta get the originals that sold, I have to get those mailed out. I didn't want to mail any of my originals during the holiday season, because that's most often times when things get broken and or get lost, and I... I cannot handle another original getting lost to UPS, FedEx, or First Priority. Like, I can't, I can't emotionally handle it anymore. And I know that that sounds so soft and so weak. But I genuinely put a lot of my heart and soul into my artwork. So to just, like, find out that a painting never gets to where it's supposed to be going and then no one knows where it is and no one can seem to find it. It's gut-wrenching because it's like, there goes 80 some odd hours of my life that I will never get back. I just posted a new video on my TikTok. I still have to post it to my Instagram and I have to run through my Notion that I set up for Lunar New York Studios. So I'm gonna work on that and then I'm gonna work on these commissions and then, what else do I want to do? I think I'm going to play around with some charcoal sketches because I just got a new sketchbook specifically for my charcoal sketches. Whenever I get a new medium or whenever I want to play with a new medium, 
I'm going to start buying a sketchbook specifically for that medium or specifically for learning that medium. However, I think with the charcoals, I might take a mixed media approach and do some charcoal drawings of flowers depending on how they look because I like that old timey illustration look that you can get from some charcoal drawings like it's I don't know I, it's hard to explain but I'll, I'll try to show you if I can get good at doing it but I want to do that for some of my paintings because I think I think it would be really really cool to have some like old timey floral illustrated flowers in the background because then it's not like so bold and in your face of like hey this is flower it's more like I'm a flower just chilling and it'll just add a more like softer feminine flow to some of my paintings which I think I need I definitely need <laughs> okay I'm gonna go get to work instead of talking to you guys because it's so easy to talk to y'all all day especially when I have no structure and a free will to just say whatever I want but that can get me so, before I get myself into trouble, I'm going to go and do exactly what I just told you that I was going to do, and keep it me. There will probably be like a voiceover cutesiness something. I don't know. Who knows? Okay, so I've pretty much been working on these commissions since I last checked in with you, and... I definitely think I'm done with the cat. Um, it's, it's cute. So I definitely think Kitty is done. Her name's Aura. She's definitely done. Um, and I'm sorry if I'm looking over it this way. I'm still using my phone as my camera, and it's hard to make sure that I'm frame. I don't know. It's weird vlogging in general is just weird. I forgot to hook my mic on again. See, I'm not very good at this, and this should just be attested proof that, you know, you don't have to be good at something to get started. But anyways, I've been working on these commissions. Kitty, I'm pretty sure Kitty is done. And then Puppy is getting some I'll get that later. Puppy is getting some work done as well. You can see that. I don't know. I'm so bad at this. I'm so bad at this. But yeah, I think I'm going to take a break from painting because I got some black and white layers uh, done on Puppy and I want to wait for them to dry before I really touch anything else because yeah. It, it helps to, with acrylic paper, it helps to wait for things to completely dry sometimes to make sure that the tone is correct. And I don't want to sit here and paint in brown first covering the white part of her chest unless it's the right tone. I mean, I could very easily just fix it, but then it creates a streaky little mess and I don't like it. So, yeah, that's pretty much going to be it for today is commission work and I think I have some stuff that I have to do in my notion which I'm going to switch over to doing some work on my notion I know I definitely hit some of my daily goals which means I'm contributing to my yearly goals which is super exciting so I have a couple of things that I have to do and then I'm pretty much done for the day I can spend the rest of the evening working on this commission or playing around with my sketchbook or editing a video or doing something. I don't know. I'm not really 100% sure what I'm going to do for the night, but I had a really successful day. Granted, this morning was really, really difficult in like just getting started for content because tripods kept falling over, things weren't charged, I couldn't find other things, things are just kind of a mess. But after that whole thing and getting some artwork done, I definitely feel a lot better about my productivity for the day. So I need to stop saying filler words. I need to branch my vocabulary. <clears throat> Frog. I need to branch my vocabulary out so I'm not using filler words anymore.
build my vocabulary, become, become the smart individual, which I am not. Okay, I'm gonna go, have a good day, have a good week. Mainly have a good day because I'm hoping I'm going back to daily vlog, vlog. Words are hard. <clears throat> I'm hoping that I can go back to daily vlogging. Let's see how consistent I am with it, depending on how today went. <laughs> but all in all, it was a good day. So, peace out, Girl Scout. Nobody knows.